Good morning, Brent Davidson, uh, planning operations trainee here with Southwest Team 3 and an update on the McCash fire. Uh, so the fire continued to be active yesterday. It was under a pretty thick smoke inversion for a lot of the day and that, uh, that cleared out in the afternoon and fire activity increased quite a bit. Um, fire does continue to burn out here in the wilderness area. Um, uh, just kind of moving along. There's a lot of uh, beneficial fire out there, cleaning up some of the understory, uh, kind of mixed severity. Uh, the concentration of effort though, with all the values is, is more over the west side and the northern portion of the fire for right now. Um, so yesterday there was some activity um, that moved uh, kind of uh, from the, the, the T-Bar Creek a little bit area, um, kind of up to the north, northeast uh, along here. Um, yesterday afternoon, a couple hours of, of pretty good fire behavior in there. Um, crews uh, yesterday concentrated mainly on, on all the structures and things in T-Bar and Patterson, and it will continue to be in there today. Um, last night, uh, the night shift folks did successfully complete a burnout operation, uh, tying in some handline dozer line uh, back to the 11 road and, and up along toward uh, up in the kind of this northern portion above the T Creek as well. So that was all looking good as of this morning. Um, like I said, the, the, the crews coming in today are going to take over that area, hold some of that burnout from last night and, and focus on um, the structure protection efforts here along the west side. Um, no real aircraft uh, yesterday on the fire. Uh, due to a number of things, other fires uh, using them, uh, some, and all the inversion and, and thick smoke in the area, just unable to fly on the fire yesterday. Um, we'll look at that again today. It's a little bit clearer and see if that aviation is able to, to assist with some of, the, some of the areas along the northern portion and uh, anything that they need over here on the west. Um, overall today, um, calling for a southwest wind and, and a little bit clearer skies out there today, so we could see some more activity in the area on the fire. Um, crews will also continue to, you know, assess uh, things up to the uh, west, or I'm sorry, to the northern part of uh, the Highway 96 corridor. They'll continue working on some structure protection efforts, uh, just making sure everything's accounted for in that area. Um, this will be the, uh, the last update, uh, last morning update from uh, Southwest Team 3. Tomorrow we'll transition to uh, Great Basin Team 3, another Type 2 incident management team, and uh, they'll be uh, in charge of the fire starting tomorrow morning. That's it for the McCash Fire for today. Thanks.